All right, let's turn to politics now, the presidential race, and the issue of money facing Hillary Clinton. She kicks off a fundraising swing through Florida today while facing some new scrutiny over her own personal wealth. NBC's Andrea Mitchell has more on that. Andrea, good morning to you. Good morning, Matt. Hillary Clinton is appealing to middle-class voters with economic policies aimed at the Democratic base. But could all the talk about the Clinton money get in the way of her populist message? Hillary Clinton in South Carolina Wednesday, campaigning as a champion of everyday people. We're going to have to stand up to the people who want to keep the deck stacked in favor of those at the top. But both Hillary and Bill Clinton are being trailed by questions over money, including foreign donations to the Clinton Foundation and their own finances, after raking in $25 million in paid speeches since the beginning of 2014. Fueling the controversy, recent revelations from the AP that Bill Clinton had a shell company, WJC LLC, in which money could pass unreported. It's Hillary Clinton from the only Republican woman in the race, Carly Fiorina, who showed up outside Clinton's event. People expect basic questions to be asked of anyone running for president. What have you done? Are you trustworthy? Are you transparent? Will you answer questions? Clinton's sole Democratic challenger so far, Senator Bernie Sanders, is going after her high-dollar speeches, telling CNBC's John Harwood... When you hustle money like that, you don't sit in restaurants like this. Mm -hmm. You sit in restaurants where you spend, I don't know what they spend, hundreds of dollars for dinner and so forth. The Clintons have stumbled over questions about their wealth. We came out of the White House not only dead broke, but in debt. Will you continue to give speeches? Oh, yeah. But I, I got to pay our bills. With the election still more than a year away, Hillary Clinton is trying to avoid making her wealth a liability, like Mitt Romney in 2012. Still, with voters like these Southern women, Clinton is down home, trying to motivate her base. 